points, rays, lines, and segments. Point The first geometric figure to learn about is a point. A point is a definite place in a space that doesn't have a size or shape. Here is a point named A, plotted on the graph. Notice that the point does name a location, but it does not have a size or shape. Naming a geometric figure is a way to identify it in a mathematical sentence. Ray A ray has an end point, but extends in one direction indefinitely. Here is a picture of a ray. Notice that this ray has two points. It has one point, point A, that is the end point, and one point, point B, which is on the line. To name the ray, we use the letters of the two points and a symbol. The symbol looks like a small ray that is above the letters. Line segment. Our third geometric figure is a line. We often think of a line as looking like this. However, in geometry, this would be a line segment. A line segment has two endpoints. Because this line does not have arrows on the ends, it means that the ends stop. A line segment is a set of connected points, meaning that while we see a straight line segment here, it is really a whole bunch of connected points. Two of the points on the line have been named. They are points A and B. We can name this line segment by using a small line segment above the two endpoints. The symbol is the small line segment. When you see this symbol, you know that you are working with a line segment. If the example above is a line segment, what does a line look like? Line. A line has an arrow on each end. A line is also a set of connected points, but the line does not end, as indicated by the arrows. A line goes on and on and on indefinitely. Two of the points have been named on the line. These are the two points that we will use to name the line. The symbol for a line is a small line with arrows on the end. The symbol goes above the name points on the line to name the line. 